Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. Today we've got this thing, which is the PS Clifton, which is sinkable, apparently. It's a pedal steamer, so um, that's going to be interesting to see how this works. Let's get on with it. So this was built by GB Danny. GB Danny, I haven't actually tested out anything of his recently, but he usually builds really cool things. And this doesn't look uh, all that bad. So uh, we're going to go ahead and get inside. And we're going to get it moving. Now we might actually have to go downstairs and start it. Um, to begin with, yeah, it's probably, that's probably what we're going to have to do. Let's go find where we need to do that. Yeah, hello, where are the engines? Where are the en engine room? Here we go. Oh, whoa, what? What is going on here? Oh, this is weird. This is really weird. Boiler door. I guess we don't really need to open that. Light boiler. There we go. We've lit the boiler. Oh, look at that. That's interesting. All right, let's close that door. Close that door. Main steam valve. Increase it. Yeah, we might explode, actually. Quickly, get to the top. Go, 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 go. We need to get up there, quick. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Quick, get inside. There we go. Uh, so we're probably going to end up actually... Uh... Wait, is it working? <gasps> it's working. Are they paddling? They're paddling. Look at that. Wow. That's so interesting. Very interesting. Okay, so we do have an anchor. We got some lights as well. Let's go ahead and put all the lights on. There we go. Uh, hopefully, we'll continue going forwards even if I get out of the seat. Yep, looks like that's what's happening. If we have a quick look through there, you guys can see the paddles. Yeah. All right. I wasn't expecting it to look like this. This is a little toilet. Okay, interesting. This is storage. Okay, interesting as well. Very interesting. And back here, we got a passenger cabin. Wait, is it downstairs? Oh, interesting. We got a little bit of a fireplace down here. And then we just got like a little bit of a seating area. Nice. Okay. This kind of reminds me of the, the little steamers on um, in the Lake District. Yeah. They're, they're not actually paddle steamers, but they're steamboats. Which is cool. Very cool. What is this? Release tie down? No. Oh, I didn't actually want to do that. Uh, can I reattach this? Hold on. I got a plan. I got a plan. Here we go. There we go. I connected it back on. That's actually quite easy to do. Very easy to do. So that's our little lifeboat at the back. Can we go down here? What is this? What is this little area? Oh, you can play poker down here. You can go into the engine room. Look at that. Look at that. Wow. That is really interesting. Very interesting. We got a few little details down here. Whoa, okay, that's dangerous. You can actually walk behind these. Okay, don't do that. Don't do that. It's not a good idea. Uh, but we got a bed and stuff in here, which is nice if you want to come down here for a rest. We got a little equipment cupboard. We can go ahead and close that up. We got one on the other side as well. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty happy with that. What's inside here, though? A locker. Aha. Uh -huh. Cool. Cool. Okay, let's go upstairs. Let's get out of here. Because uh, otherwise we're going to have a few problems. There we go. Good. Um, I kind of want to put it up against some waves and stuff. I don't think it's going to be very good against waves. But we'll see how it is. Here we go. Full wind. Full wind. Actually, you know what? It might be completely fine against waves. Because it's so wide. It is unbelievably wide. And we are still moving. Completely fine. Does it move with a rudder? Is, is that what turns us? Or is it... Yeah, it's a rudder that turns us. I was wondering whether it just turned off one of the side ones or not. Also, look at that. Clifton. Wow. Wow. I gotta admit, this thing is this thing is not very nice. Uh, like, not very fast. Sorry, not very nice. Um, we are going, like, a decent speed, though, to be fair. So if we wanted to do a mission, we could. But I want to see if the uh, the autopilot works. We're going to try and go all the way out to uh, this wind turbine, which is how far away? 3.3 kilometers. Okay. Go ahead and set it in our GPS. Bam. And do this. There we go. We should just continue towards our destination, which is nice. What else have we got in here? We got a horn. Wait, the horn doesn't appear to work. The horn isn't working. Why? The horn, the horn doesn't work. That's strange. Very strange. But I mean, it's not a massive part of this thing anyway, so it doesn't matter. Uh, what if we jump on this? Let's get in this little boat. Here we go. All right, we're sitting down in the seat. Drop. Okay. Uh... Uh, guys, this is not how it's supposed to work, I don't think. 
Help! I don't know how to fix this. I don't know how to fix this at all. What's it connected by? We might be able to connect it again and then it'll fix us. There we go. Alright, okay, okay. Lower. Yes, keep lowering it down. Yes, what are we stuck on? Oh, we're stuck on the boat. We're stuck on the boat itself. Uh-oh. Right, we're in a bit of a predicament now. If I get out of this seat, we're probably going to lose everything. I've jumped out of the seat. Oh, I've jumped out of the seat. Wait, am I quicker than the boat? I'm quicker than the boat. All right, good, 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 good. Jump on. Jump on the boat. No. Jump on the boat. No. Try again. Try again. Okay, idea. Idea instead. Jump on this boat. Grab a handle or something. Oh, yes. We did it. We did it. All right, let go. Jump aboard. Jump. Oh, I've fallen off. I've fallen off again. It's being dragged around all over the place. I'm sure I can get in the seat, though. There we go. I'm in the seat. Okay, drop it. Wait, it's not working. Drop it. Drop? Drop it. Okay, we're going to have to do this manually. There we go. I did it. I did it. We've done it manually. Okay, get in the lifeboat, thinking, my Bobby, and get out of here. Oh, I almost got chopped up. Okay, off we go. Hopefully we're faster than the main thing, but I don't think we are. We seem pretty slow. Yeah, this thing is actually really, really slow. I don't think this is actually a lifeboat. Oh, maybe it is. Is it a lifeboat? What is it? What is it? It might be a, a tender. A te tender? So, like, these went and got coal? Question mark? I don't really know. I don't know what's going on. Um, but it's definitely not as fast as that thing. That's for sure. Okay, so it is still working. Um, I just got it back from the middle of the ocean because I was never going to catch it. But um, if we go down here again, we can go ahead and restart the engine. So we light the boiler. Hold that. And then stuff should happen. There we go. The steam pressure is going up. The boiler temperature is going up. The water level is okay. All right, nice. Okay, let's go back upstairs. And uh, we'll start pedaling again. Okay, so it's always going to happen in these videos. I want to uh, put ourselves up against the tsunami, because why not, you know? Peddler, steam peddler versus tsunami. Let's do it. It's actually way faster than you would think it was. Like, 10 knots is not bad. Is this a door? Oh, this is a door. You can go and stand on the outside if you want to. I don't know why you would want to do that, but you can do it. It's also got an anchor, too. And that noise is really annoying. I don't know what it is. What is this? What? We got a bilge pump. In case any water gets in, we might need that. We might need that. I want to give that a try. All right, okay. I'm going to leave a door open to the boiler room. No, actually, no. Probably not to the boiler room. Let's leave a door open to to this back here, the passenger cabin. We'll let the water go in, and then we'll see if the bilge pump actually works. Yeah, seems like a good idea. However, I might die. I don't know whether I'll be safe in here, but I'm, I'm going to hope for the best. All right, it's getting closer and closer and closer. I'm I'm hoping we don't die here. Engine? Wait. Oh, is that my uh, throttle? No. I don't know what that is. Oh, no. Maybe it is. Yeah, it is. It is. That's my throttle. Okay, we're getting tipped over. S oh, God. We are getting tipped over side. We have flipped over. Am I underwater? I'm underwater. Oh, not good. Not good. Oh, we flipped all the way back over. And we are back to normal. Yes. All right. We survived a tsunami. Easy peasy. Now we just need to see if there's any water in here. If there is water in here, I want to see if we can get it out. There is water. Okay, interesting. Very interesting. Bilge pump, do it. Do your business. Go. There we go. We'll see if the water's slowly getting out. I hope it does. I hope it does. Is it moving? I don't think it's moving. Maybe the pump doesn't actually work in here. No, it, it totally does. Is it going down? I think the water level is going down. Very slowly. Maybe it's actually a different room that this is attached to? I'm not entirely sure, but it doesn't seem to be emptying it uh, too well. If it is emptying it, that's good, but I, I don't think it is. Oh, we could actually see the engine from here. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice. What happens if I jump in and, and we, like, get tangled in there? Is it okay if we do that? Let's have a quick little look here. Let's have a quick little look. I need to get up to the paddle. Okay, go, 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 go. Here we go. Ready? It just pushes me away. It's just pushing me away. Okay, get in front of it, maybe. No, I, I can't actually get in front of it. Oh, here we go. Actually, I can. I can. I can. Are you ready? We're just going to get, like, catapulted backwards. I know, but... 
Yeah, we get like slam dunked. That's what happens. Oh no, it's getting away. Come back. Okay, but yeah, very interesting boat. I think I'm gonna go ahead and jump onto another boat now so that we have more than one boat of video. That seems like a good idea. Uh, if you guys wanna check this out, I'll link it down below. And there's a flag, too. Wow, that's crazy. Okay, so this is what I wanted to look at. Now, someone sent me this and was like, well, this is how you should do your engines on your submarine. And I looked at it, and it looks kind of interesting. So, the the exhaust goes into uh, little tanks. Hold on, if we can see back here. The exhaust goes into all these, like, cream beige tanks. Um, and then the air actually gets pumped into the blue tanks, I believe. And that is that is how it works. Okay, which, which seems a little interesting. Um... Yeah, so we'll like pump air to engine. Here we go. There we go. And then pump exhaust out. There we go. So you sort of do both of those. The air is getting pumped in. Okay, so we can use the air underwater. Okay. If we start the engine and we do this, then it works. Okay. So it's using the air in the tanks. If we then we go ahead and we turn this off, we should still have air, right? Maybe that's maybe that doesn't work. I don't know. We still have air in the tanks, but it's not starting now. That's really interesting. Very interesting. I wonder why that is. I wonder why. Okay, right. Well, if we go back in here and we try it again, so we got air in tanks. Okay, there we go. It doesn't want to work. It's very strange. Very very strange. I mean, I can see the idea behind it. Maybe it worked in a previous a previous update, but it, it doesn't seem to work now. Unless I turn it on again. Wait, pump air to engine. Oh, here we go. There we go. Okay, so you pump the air to the engine and the, the exhaust to the tanks. Okay, so the exhaust should start filling up. And the air is going down. Aha, uh -huh, and we're moving forwards. Fantastic. Now if we go underneath the water... It should still work fine. Indeed it does. Aha. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. So the exhaust is actually going into tanks, which means we don't really need to worry about um, pressure because the tanks are inside the submarine and that's the pressure's already dealt with. Then, oh Jesus. Okay, well we just smacked it into a wall, interestingly enough. Um, but yeah, that is a really good, really good way of doing it. I will link this submarine down below as well if you guys want to have a quick look at it. But I just wanted to look at how it was done. Um, so if we, on our submarine, pump our exhaust into tanks as well, then it might work if we still use the air buoy. Alright, yeah, I'm probably going to use that. Anyway, uh, whoever sent me this, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Okay, so just to go over that again so that I actually remember what I'm doing, we need to pump the, the, the exhaust into tanks and the air into tanks. Actually, I'm going to leave the air as, as a big buoy. A big buoy. Okay, so we do this. Pumps air in. Okay, there we go. That should start filling this up, which indeed it does. We then do this. Actually, this and this as well. There we go. Beautiful. I don't know how we empty the exhaust tanks. Oh, here we go. So that should empty the exhaust. Aha, I see. Okay. Cool. I like this. I like this. It's a good idea. It's a very good idea. Okay, right. So we then do this. Because we've got enough air, right? Yeah, we got 6,000. We then close this up. Water pumps. Wait, what does that do? I don't know what that does, but that's okay. Let's get inside. Can we, like, dive? Here we go. Why does it show fuel on that side? It shows us fuel here, but, like, it doesn't show us our diving stuff. Interesting. Two is spotlights. Okay, so we got spotlights somewhere. There they are. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. Crazy. We got our speed up here. We've also got our depth meter right here as well. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. There's a fish down there. Oh, there's a bunch of fish. I'm going to ram the fish. Oh, I can't catch the fish. Never mind. I can't catch fish. It's okay, though. What about this one? No, nope. they're very fast. The fish are very fast. Oh, I like it, though. I like it. We all live in a yellow submarine. A yellow submarine. A yellow submarine. Okay, right. We're going to use this on ours. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys for watching now. Um, I just wanted to quickly check this thing out because, um, yeah, it was interesting. Anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.